Is the American apocalypse almost here? Are all the bad decisions we've made over the last few decades finally catching up to us? It's starting to happen right now. Let's take a look. Banks are collapsing and with it, companies' profits are suddenly disappearing. The record profits companies made in 2022 with skyrocketing inflation are being completely wiped out as more and more banks go out of business. Profits that were made during the short pricing boom coming out of the pandemic in 2022, unfortunately, didn't go into the company's infrastructure or workers' paychecks. Instead, the money they made went into shareholders' pockets. Even though employees were forced to work extra hard during that year, the profits weren't going to them and it wasn't going to buy new equipment. So where did all this money go? The record-breaking profits that companies bragged about went back into their shareholders' and executives' pockets. Companies plowed the money right back into stock buybacks. Stock buybacks that raised share prices and made their wealthy stockholders even wealthier. And at the same time gave a higher inflated valuation to their company. So now they could leverage their outsized company valuations and take out last minute loans from banks before the interest rates started to rise. But now we're on the brink of a financial recession. So all of those loans that the companies made, they're having to pay back with an adjusted interest rates and the interest rates are still going up. So how do companies keep up with this? They can't sell more products because people aren't buying as much because everything costs so much money. People are going into debt right now. Credit card debt is the highest it's been in years. Companies have to cut costs somehow. So they start laying off workers. No new employees, no new equipment. And those employees that are left will have to work even harder. Mom and pop companies have all but disappeared. And yet those were the companies which kept our economy competitive and actually lowered prices. Now they're gone. It's just mega corporations and super hedge fund conglomerates. They've been absorbing everything. They've become the de facto new rulers of our corporately run society. And they'll continue to do so. Soon, we'll end up working for a few companies. They'll dictate our wages and they'll dictate how much we have to pay them for all the things we need just to survive because they'll own everything and we'll have nothing. And that's exactly what the WEF, the World Economic Forum, planned. That's in their playbook. They want that to happen by the year 2030. Our system has been broken for too long. We need new and innovative ways to pick things up and strengthen ourselves and our economy. If you've enjoyed this podcast, if you've learned something from it, please like, subscribe, and share. And as always, we'll see you next time on Shine 365.